firefighters like to be prepared, of course, and plan for every outcome. That's why the newest addition to Station One's roof is bringing a lot of excitement. Yeah, the roof. Fox 12's Zach Anders joins us now live in studio to explore the new tool that firefighters will have back at their home base. Zach? It's pretty neat, too. Since 2016, Fire Station One has worked to install a solar panel array on its roof. This week, they brought them online, and while a dip in the electric bill is expected, the introduction of a new kind of technology could extend their usefulness even after the sun goes down. Portland Fire has flipped the switch at Station One, bringing a new energy system online this week, a solar array that feeds a 30 kilowatt battery, meaning in the worst of scenarios, Station One could be the only fire station in the city with a continuous power supply. Most commercial solar applications only work when the sun is shining, but with the addition of a battery, that energy can be saved. Up until recently, it was hard to pull off, but given the uh, um, the cost of battery technology and the controls have come down significantly. This refrigerator sized battery stores the energy from the solar panels, providing three to four hours of critical systems electricity. It might not sound like a lot, but in a disaster, that time could be vital. All of our fire stations have the capability to function in the case uh, of a loss of power in the power grid. Um, we have generators at each of those stations, but of course those generators require fuel. This definitely allows this fire station to be independent of that. So while solar here will supplement a generator most of the time, if that generator can't be refueled, station one can still keep going. It'll lengthen the amount of time that we have generator power before running out of fuel. Um, and ideally that will be, um, you know, we'll have the lights back on before that happens. But if we were to uh, use all the fuel in the generator, then the solar panels can continue to uh, um, to fuel the battery and continue to um, have limited operation um, indefinitely. In a weird way, I'm kind of excited to see the next time the power goes down so that so we can see the system truly shine. I don't really wish for an extended outage, maybe just a couple of minutes, just yeah. to be sure. <laughs> Portland Fire tries to plan for each station's role in a citywide disaster scenario like a major earthquake. If an event was strong enough to knock out the power grid for more than a few days, they say it's likely their ability to maintain a steady flow of diesel fuel for dozens of generators would likely have been hindered too. So this backup to the backup could really make a difference. Reporting live in studio, Zach Anders, Fox 12 Oregon.